if you want to work with Z spheres, just go into your tool menu and click on Z sphere. It's going to create a new separate tool. And as soon as you move out of draw mode into edit mode, you should be able to start drawing additional Z spheres on it. When you press W, E, and R, it's going to give you the ability to switch between the different modes. Draw allows you to draw a new Z sphere, and then you can use those other modes of rotation and scale in order to really control what's going on with your z-spheres through that mesh. You can do this with symmetry on so that it'll create multiple z-spheres at once and keep things together. When you decide that you're happy with what you've got, go down to adaptive skin and click preview and it's going to show you what happens. You can of course change the density of this mesh. Once you're happy with that you have to click make adaptive skin. Now when you click make adaptive skin this is still the Z spheres. In fact if we turn off preview you'll see that this is actually the Z spheres. Don't get confused and start sculpting on that. Instead go find the new adaptive skin that you made. It'll be called skin Z sphere and this will be safe to now start sculpting on.